So the hierarchy of management tools then talks about policy. This is a very general standpoint <coughs> of uh, uh, national policy that translates into standards. Your standards then are uh, checked by means of operating procedures. And then you have your performance indicators to indicate whether you're performing your operations in an acceptable way and meeting standards. Entonces lo que nosotros tenemos dentro de la framework de la definición es que nosotros tenemos políticas nacionales, sobre la política nosotros tenemos estándares, sobre los estándares nosotros tenemos procedimientos operacionales y sobre los procedimientos operacionales nosotros tenemos indicadores de performance. We have this term of sustainability arising at this stage where the commitment to the regulatory requirements and policies are long term. So we have to look at the long term type of activity beyond the operation of your money. Entonces, las consideraciones de sostenibilidad del proyecto son en largo tiempo, incluso mucho después de que tu proyecto haya terminado. And at this stage, or in association with sustainability and understanding this engagement of stakeholders in the planning and implementation of AR management. So in your overall mine permitting, and you have this component of plan in the permitting process, is that you make the stakeholders aware of what you're wanting to do, what you're suggesting, what their expectations might be. Entonces, eh, aquí te incorporamos un tema de lo que es el... el la participación de los actores dentro del planeamiento y la implementación es que los actores de decisión vengan a ser los inversionistas, sepan cuál es tu plan de manejo de drenaje de ciudad de roca y que vean a dónde quieren llegar. So, even though you attempt to maintain environmental protection during all stages of the mine cycle, it's especially critical in post closure when your mining operations are stopped. Y también enfocar que el manejo de la protección ambiental es el más crítico en la fase de cierre. Some of the other aspects, and again, for sake of time, we'll talk about all these, but uh, uh, let's see, well, the, yeah, the well-being of nearby communities during the following operations is quite important. So this is this interaction with mining operations with the uh, potentially affected communities. And special attention should be given to the social aspects and the environmental impact assessment aspects. Of course, this is uh, to be addressed. It's very important. Entonces, dentro de la gestión del drenaje a cielo roca, se debe ver el tema de la el bienestar de las comunidades y también enfocarse en la comunicación a las comunidades durante la fase de operación y también durante la fase de cierre. My life cycle, in other words, going from pre-mining to construction operation to post closure. Uh, the environmental and community impacts and costs are very important. And particularly on the ending side is that you may be employing a large number of people during mine operations and trying to anticipate what these people will be doing after the first. Entonces, una de las cosas que, que se tiene que evaluar son los ambientes, los aspectos impacto ambiental en la comunidad y el tema de costos, porque en el tema de costos hay que hablar muy bien cuáles son los costos que se van a incluir con este sistema de armonías. So, bottom line is the underlying concept is to evaluate, understand, maximize the contributions that money makes to sustainable goals. Entonces, eh, una conclusión es que se debe entender que se debe evaluar, entender y maximizar las contribuciones que la minería eh, hace a la gestión sostenible. Y la implicación es que estos conceptos raise, raise the bars at the bar higher than conventional environmental permitting, normal environmental impact assessment permits. Entonces, el, el tema acá de este es enfoque preventivo es que uno va a poner la brecha muy alta, que es más alta de lo que es el enfoque tradicional del impacto ambiental. And the application of sustainability then, of course, strives to maintain improved overall community conditions. Entonces, pero sin embargo, este enfoque a su vez ayuda a mejorar las condiciones de la comunidad. Of course, the term community may be more, more aerial expansive, not just 
people living nearby for mine operations for the whole region. Entonces, pero el tema de comunidad no solo es la comunidad que está viviendo al costado de tu mina, sino es una, tendría que ser una comunidad que está viviendo en toda la región. Or a whole, whole nation, you know, país. So, developing an acid rock drainage management plan, uh, again, going back through the various phases, pre mm -hmm. mining operations, closing, and then comments in terms of what you do with ADR. This is just a summary that's given in chapter 9. Eh, esto de acá es eh, un resumen de lo que ya han visto antes cómo se manejó desde la creación por etapa de la mina. Other components of the management plan then are uh, comprised of this uh, ARD control, which is a multidisciplinary task, and how this varies during the mine life cycle. Entonces, otro componente del plan de manejo es el eh, cómo se controla el drenaje ácido de roca, que es un aspecto multidisciplinario, y cómo se mejora a su vez el plan de manejo And as indicated by an earlier slide, was that the engineering design process is an iterative process to evaluate the range of technologies and or control measures to identify the most effective and cost-effective options or options. So you're continually evaluating this during the life cycle. Entonces, el proceso de gestión del manejo del drenaje ha sido es iterativo. ¿Por qué? Porque a su vez se van teniendo más datos y se van mejorando los enfoques. This I will not discuss now, but it essentially is, uh, looks at the likelihood of something happening versus the consequence. In other words, you have an extreme adverse impact with a high likelihood. Uh, this is your sort of red flag that you have to deal with more critically, but I think it's down on this lower level. Bueno, esa es una matriz de riesgo donde lo que uno tiene que tratar son lo, lo, los riesgos de más alta probabilidad con las peores consecuencias. And then monitoring performance assessment of success. Uh, again, these are some of the questions that you ask in terms of assessment and then the nature of monitoring that's required in this area. Whether you look at it, uh, groundwater, surface water, water quality, or other types of testing. And then the implementation and performance indicators, these are the measures that may be built into the permit and to assess whether these questions are going to address properly. Yeah. Es una fase donde uno quiere evaluar cómo está, cómo está evaluando si su el éxito de tus medidas de, de tu plan de, de manejo de, 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 de drenaje ácido primero tú te pones preguntas de evaluación luego tú ves qué monitoreo estás realizando y después ese monitoreo tiene que estar eh, viendo si tú estás completando ciertos, ciertos indicadores de gestión This is a, a table out of the guide, a guide, a guide manual so table 9.4 and only this the first aspect. This is a, essentially a two or three page uh, matrix of questions. What do you do and what are the indicators? Entonces, esto de aquí solo es la primera parte de la tabla. En realidad la tabla es lo que sigue por dos páginas y media. Pero bueno, son las distintas cosas que se pueden evaluar. So, integrating ADR management, ARD management into money process operations. This is, uh, again, just to make sure that you're Incorporated the ARD aspects and the other aspects of, of your management model, your environmental management model. Entonces, es un diagrama de flujo de cómo su, cómo tu manejo de, de, de la gestión de rocas suele se complementa con todo el manejo de la. More quickly, is uh, these additional features, is uh, these aspects of environmental awareness. This is important from the stakeholder standpoint. Environmental reporting, also and how you report the results, as you said before, uh, that's very uh, important uh, relative to the ARD uh, impacts. Entonces, dos aspectos a considerar es cuál es el, la preocupación ambiental y cuál es el, cómo uno reporta los datos. Es importante considerar. And so, it's not only important from the standpoint of the technical people that are developing these aspects, but the personnel from the corporate environment. They have to understand what's going on here and how it is uh, being 
presented to the general public and also have the understanding of what the uh, economic implications are. Entonces, no solo es reportar los datos a la gente, a las personas técnicas, sino también es reportar los datos hacia la población y, entender, y lograr que la población entienda lo que uno quería decir. And accidents do happen, so the, the last component here deals with the effect of when you have the monitoring criteria are exceeded or you have non-compliance with some action or some skill or accident that this is dealt with in a proper way. Entonces, también se pueden haber problemas y derrames de que generen peraje hacia el rojo, entonces se debe setearlo, se debe decir los procedimientos para, este, para el caso de emergencia. Ok, skip over that. We've seen this before, that we had before. The long-term considerations then are the resources needed for the long-term planning and management. The information, institutional knowledge, retention. What happens is over the periods that we're talking about here, which may be decades, 30 to 50 years, that personnel will change. You have to make sure you have your continuity, so leaving your uh, legacy of monitoring programs and actions that are taking place are quite important. And lastly, changing standards to try to minimize those and the stakeholder needs and expectations have to be fulfilled throughout the long term. Entonces, dentro de las consideraciones son los recursos y también hay un tema acá que es este, la, la perpetuidad en, las, en los organismos reguladores. ¿Por qué? Porque eso va a tomar décadas. Entonces, muchas veces los planes de remediación y la supervisión del plan de manejo de drenaje así, va a pasar de una persona a otra persona en los cargos públicos. Ok, so we're not taking a break for coffee for another 10 minutes. <laughs> Two, four, 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 four. Can you set me up? Oh. Which, which one we? Oh, 2.4.